Longview, Texas, and I drive for Boss Transportation. Been in the trucking industry since 1979 when I joined the Army. is where I learned to drive a truck and has been doing it ever since. My specialty is the heavy loads. I enjoy the heavy loads. A little bit more challenge, a little bit more, you know, it, uh, I guess a little bit more pride. And, and I enjoy the flatbed industry because it's not closing doors, it's putting it on there, tying it down. Boss Transportation, we haul, when we're working on the crane side, we haul from crane weights to booms, winches that go on the cranes, take it from one location to another, help them put it back together. And when we're not doing uh, boss crane and rigging freight, we're doing freight from Bennett. And our, my, my main deal with Bennett is I haul a lot of inverters for the solar industry. Set it on the trailer, tie it down, and away we go. Boss Transportation was mentioned to me by an employee that used to work here, Alvin Lloyd. He used to work for me. I said, let me give it a try. Come over here. Uh, he hauled around a little bit. I said, no, nah, yeah, no, yeah. I finally decided to come, and I've enjoyed it ever since I've been here. For me, what's changed is the longer you're in the industry, the more experience you get, and you figure out little old niches about fuel mileage and everything. The technology on these trucks nowadays is, is unreal. My goal coming to Boss is to get out here since it's a local company. I live here in town. My goal was to be home on the weekends, be home more, which I've managed to do. Uh, get out here and share my experience with some of the other drivers that's here. Let them help, you know, help them along the way. There was a neighbor of ours that lived, I was raised in New Orleans. There was a neighbor of ours that lived two houses down. He drove a truck. And from the time he brought that truck home, I was sold. I was probably 12 years old. And it, uh, from that time, I, I would spend time at his house. I always admired his truck. I always just sitting there drooling, you know. And he took me on as like, uh, as one of his kids. And we, uh, you know, never got to ride with him or anything, but he just, just the influence that he made a good living and I've managed to do pretty good with the trucking industry. And it was just uh, just something I wanted to do from the time I seen his truck, from the time I stepped in his truck. The driver, leave your cell phone at home. I, but you can't do it, don't get me wrong. Leave, just, just pay attention to what you're doing. That cell phone will ring later. You can call later. It. Uh, I see so much stuff happen because of cell phone. And you know, it's it's, it's bad, it, and I, you know, I'm guilty. You know, on the cell phone, we use headset, Bluetooth, company policy. I enjoy it, but but just pay attention to what you're doing. You know, let us show you what we can do, and I think we can do it. All the new customers, we're ready when you are. Just bring on the work. We can handle it.